This is my review and unboxing for MovieBlocks.com and this is a new movie subscription box. There are two different um, kinds. There's the DVD which is $20 a month and the Blu-ray which is $23 a month. I do have a coupon to code to save you 15% and I will include that with this review. Now when you sign up you get to choose between two different plans. The original plan and then a kid friendly plan. So I am reviewing the kid friendly plan for boys. Um, when you sign up for the kid friendly plan you can choose between girls and boys both in DVD and Blu-ray. So everything comes in this box. It's just kind of a plain box and they added like the, it has a little movie block um, lid to it. And like in, in this box in addition to them you'll get either a DVD or a movie. You'll also get like surprises, candy, popcorn, that kind of thing. So let's see what's in here. Um, here is a little welcome. Um, some extra goodies for being one of our first subscribers. And if you tag us with pictures of your unboxing, you'll receive an extra goodie in your next box. So there you go. And I think that's to anybody. It's just a generic card, not just to me. All right, first thing we have in the little package, we have, um, all right, we have a minion and I'm thinking he's Bob, but I don't know. If he's not Bob, let me know. I did see the movie, but I'm not sure how well I know my minions. Here's a Superman button. And we have a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle little magnet. Pretty cute. So those are like some little bonuses in there. We have a big box of peanut M&Ms. Which is, I wish it had been plain. And this is nothing, I mean, they could know about. Just because my oldest has a peanut allergy. So this isn't something that we will, you know, eat while watching a movie together. Um, my husband will probably take them to work and eat them. But, again... I mean, they can't possibly, like, carry a box of food allergies in addition to their movie preferences. So this is in no fault to them. Just a little personal note. We have a package of microwave popcorn oval red muffers. So nice name brand. And it is still good through February 2016. It will not last that long in our house. And then... We have, here's a like an information card, Space Jam, I believe I can fly. So the featured movie in the Blu-ray is Space Jam. And um, just to give you all um, a heads up, I did peek in this box to see what movies were there because I know value is one of the things I'm sure will come up in comments, um, being that it's a movie box. So I wanted to just kind of skip ahead and see what the value was. I think this is currently selling for around $6.38 on Amazon. Um, I do not have this on Blu-ray, and when my husband saw it, he was really excited because um, he loves this movie. Alright, so back to this information card. This is, there's some little factoids in here. Um, Michael Jordan actually wore his college basketball shorts under his Chicago Bulls uniform every game as a good luck charm. I did not know that. Um, watch for this. After the alien steals... Patrick Ewing's talent, the referee shows the ball to him for a free throw. The referee throws the ball to him for a free throw. The ball hits Ewing in the chest. When Michael is watching TV and sees the replay of the incident, the ball, the ball, um, it cut off. So I don't know what happened. I don't know, something happens to the ball, so I guess I'll watch for that. Um, so that's a little error there. Okay. So that's the featured movie. It is age appropriate. Um, and then we have another a bonus DVD. This is Astro Boy Volume 1. Now I have heard of Astro Boy. I can't say I've ever watched a cartoon of him. Um, but I have heard of him. So it looks interesting. This actually retails for around 8 something on Amazon. Um, now, again, this DVD is a bonus. So... You won't always get a DVD. I've seen like some vinyl figures in some boxes. I think I saw a vinyl figure in a box. So it just kind of depends on your box on what you'll get. So that is everything in the box. Um, okay, so here are my thoughts. If you're just looking for value, you know, if, if value is your number one concern, this obviously falls short. I think this 
has a total value of around $16. Um, I think there's two kind of subscriptions. There's kind of the value where you get like a ton of snacks for kind of a low price. And then there's other ones like more artisan subscription boxes and things or boxes that are more curated for you that you're going to pay a little bit higher. Maybe you're going to pay more than the retail value, but it's going to be a more curated experience. I do wish this box had a little bit higher value because it's $23 for the, the Blu-ray option. And um, depending on what bonus extras I could have gotten, um, I mean, the total value of this box is around 16 So again, I think between 16 and 23 that's a kind of a big gap. Um, I do think this is a neat subscription, though. I mean, if you want to have, like, a little movie night, um, you know, this would be kind of a fun little subscription to share as a family if you're just looking for something the whole family can enjoy. You know, so again, overall, I think it's a cute idea, but I do think it needs to have a little bit higher value um, for the cost because... You know, again, it's around $16 value. I will say it's hard. Um, I'm sure given the market of Redbox and Amazon prices where you can get, you know, a DVD for like $2 now, it's kind of crazy to try to compare. So I do think it was a fun subscription, um, but it's not something you're going to get like $50 worth of DVDs for, you know, 20 bucks. So, you know, given these are all the facts, you can decide for yourself if this is a subscription for you. You can save 15% off your first box, and you do fill out like a little questionnaire um, on there. I would like to see, you know, maybe they could pick, have an availability of, you know, DVDs you already own, so you don't get a duplicate, because that would be bad to get like a $23 box and then get something you already own. But that's just kind of the gamble, I guess, with subscription boxes in general. So, but they do have a customized thing, and maybe as they grow, they might expand that to be able to put specific movies that you have. Um, and you might be able to just add that in there too, I'm not sure. Um, but the questions are more general, like what kind of genres do you like, or anything, types of movies that you don't want to see. So, I will have a full retail, uh, full written review on my website. I will link all of the items. Um, if you're interested in subscribing, you can check it out um, on their website, and I will link them down below. So, thanks for watching, and have a great day.